Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have been tested for several years now. Oh my god, Marcus. Oh, oh Marcus, we haven't seen Marcus in a while. interesting too like because this is so early on in this like rebellion there's no like checks like they're not worried that he might be an android you know mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm, all right. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah. You missed her. Did you spare some change? Even the way that there's, like, segregation and stuff, it's so, like, how things were, like, in... And not even that long ago is the disturbing thing. Yeah. Okay... Any of that graffiti around here? It doesn't look like there's any graffiti around here. Can I talk to her? Do you know where Jericho is? Mm, thanks anyway, Michael. <laughs> Temporary parking. What do they park for? I guess if they have to wait for an order or something. Oh, hey, look, there it is. Is there another one? Oh, here we go. More people getting rid of their androids because they're scared now. Wait, really? Where? The little girl said, are we really gonna get rid of Mandy? Oh, I didn't hear that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm sure that's definitely gonna start happening a lot. Reminds me of what happened in the Blade Runner universe, you know? There was that whole uprising, and then they were like, Oh, we discontinued that model! These new models, that won't happen! <laughs> Oh, here we go. There's one. Two. I found it interesting that Connor was able to disobey Hank, you know? And he didn't like have to do Connor that little. He definitely seems independent. He does, yeah. He does and... seem more independent. Why? I can't scan that one. And he also like man, like when he like poured out his drink or refused to get that guy coffee. Yeah. Don't get cut. <laughs> See, like, yeah. What are the rules? Like, Kara got. 
cut by some fence and it like damaged her. Oops. But she also like pulled off that thing from her forehead and didn't hurt her and I mean we saw what happened to Marcus. He wasn't covered in too much blood. Where is this leading me? Oh, I see it already. Hmm. Uh, okay. Nope. <laughs> uh, yeah. Action Marcus. <laughs> cool. Okay. Was it is there not another one there? I mean doesn't it have to be in this little space? Right? Oh wow. Oh wow, oh, I, I did not wow. see that. I I actually I didn't just didn't even see that. Okay, this looks really treacherous. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't like it. Oh god, it's gonna be a quick, quick time event. Uh. Mm -mm. All right, here we go. Is he gonna like run along the wall or something? <laughs> really? I feel like I want to do that one because that looks like it's gonna break. Mm. I'm gonna try doing this one. That's so cool. Oh, he's gonna. He's gonna. Oh, he's gonna. Oh. Oh. Okay, cool. Awesome. <laughs> okay. It's really cool being able to direct these things that we've seen androids do in like movies and stuff. Right? Kind of yeah. What yeah. What it's like for them. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah, it's really cool. I re I really I really like being able to like do this. And the way that it freezes time to kind of let you see how their perception works. Like they're making all these like uh, observations and stuff, but it's like from the outside world, it's happening literally instantaneously. Mm hmm mm hmm Wait. Oh, we're reconstructing again. Okay, where are we trying to go? Trying to get up there? Okay. He's interesting. Yeah. Parkour. <laughs> oh. Would be too high. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> Man! Oh my! Wow, he is scooty. Yeah, he's super scooty. I really like his like two colored eyes now. <laughs> it's cool. I know. I mean, there was something over here. I saw the little prompt. 
Oh, oh, I see. Oh. Oh, that's so interesting. Look at the way it's been painted. Like, huh? Neat. Oh, I, I, I didn't, I couldn't, I didn't see it. Oh. Okay. Oh. I can't get used to anything either because they just have it be different buttons all the time. Yeah, I know, like they're trying to keep you on your toes. And he looks real. <laughs> Jericho. It's an abandoned ship. Huh. Interesting. Interesting, yeah. Are there no guards around? Oh god! Oh dear. Uh, uh, that would have been hazardous. Okay. I'll parkour our way some other way. I know, right? <laughs> I was thinking that earlier, actually. Mm. I wonder how much these androids weigh, like, because, like, mm. what they're made of and how, like, are they, like, a similar weight to humans? Do they weigh more or less? For up here. Yeah, he might just go splat. Uh, oh god. Okay. Oh. Yeah, there's there was water down there, right? I guess he calculated it. I'm sure he calculated. Oh no, his cool coat! Well, now we're in a horror game again. We're- oh my god, we're back on Men of Medan! No! <laughs> uh, please, no. <laughs> Conrad? <laughs> else here like what is he gonna find here i feel like he's it gotta really find it. like it's gotta be a group of deviants right do you need a flashlight i guess so okay it's for us <laughs> yeah it's probably for us you're right Ugh. Charming place, haha. <laughs> Ew, it's like buckling. Yeah, this does not seem stable. Oh, what was Who's that? that? Hello? I'm friendly! Okay. The sounds. Okay, nothing really in here. And the effect, like the the like water droplets and stuff on his skin, it like looks I so. Know. Marcus, what are you doing? Oh, fine, be that way. Why did you look like the droplets on your chest? <laughs> <laughs> For science! <laughs> of course, of course. Ah, this could totally be a horror game. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's that just was a, a jump scare. That was a total what? jump scare. Yeah. What was it? The horrible screeching noise. I don't know. That's stupid. That's <laughs> cheap. That had to have just been a just a, a little girl. It looked like. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it trusted you, game. <laughs> This is seriously. This Why is literally turning into man a horror movie. We're literally. This is literally. I don't know. He, he's been trapped in a horror movie for half his like storyline. It's horrible. It's just a little girl like playing in these creepy rusted bowels. Okay, all right, still in a horror game. God, this place is like falling apart. Why am I looking down? Oh God! Run! How do, they, how do they live in here? I don't even understand. I thought for sure this was gonna be, ow! ow. Like seriously, how do we move about or leave, you hurt? come and go? He's interesting. Connor said they don't feel pain, but he was clearly. Oh. Uh, hi. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is Daniel. that? Welcome to Wait. Jericho. Oh my god. Um, I'm confused. Did he have a twin? Is it... can they be duplicates? Maybe so. It's the people of Jericho. Die. Now that was definitely some walking simulator. <laughs> 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 no, I want to like talk to the androids. Ah. <laughs> mm -hmm. He's probably gonna switch was... to someone else. Yeah. Are we getting some some lunch? Late lunch. Humans gotta refuel. Hank is always tense. Plastic with you. Reconcile. Bros. Number five in the third. The giddy split. Billy's one hell of a chaser. You wanna flood him? Last shit hot tip you gave me sent me back a week's wages. <laughs> Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. Yeah, right. What am I what am I doing? What am I discovering here? Food hygiene? Ew, it got a C? That's bad, right? I'd imagine so. That it sounds like that seems shack. like a it seems like a bad rating. Gambling and fraud, okay. Charmed. Resisting arrest, breach of hygiene regulations. Ew. Gross. Gonna scan you too, Frank. Hank. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh, he was born in 1985. We know his birthday now. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, he's like our age. Oh my god, he's like our age. That's so weird. I mean, you know, how old we would be. So let's see, it's 2038 minus 1985. So he's 53. Okay. He does look a little older than 53. He does. Yeah. He's probably like 65. Our food prepared by a human. Oh, I see. Like it's not androids that don't cook. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yeah, All right, I'm android in. would be nice and Damn strict. Mm -hmm. be, hey, you know, pews or. What is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. <laughs> oh, here come the here come the comics where oh 
Where Connor's a poodle. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sure it exists. Yeah, I'm sure it exists. Apologize for behavior. Partners reconcile. Review facts. I guess, I mean, that our mission was to reconcile. Should we open hmm. with that? <laughs> I mean, we might as well. Let's, yeah. I think our relationship got off on the wrong foot. We should forget what happened and start over. What do you say? Look. I'm Connor. <laughs> a piece of plastic for a partner, and I'm dealing with it. But if you think we're going to be buddies, you're as stupid as you look. <laughs> mean. He's precious. There you go. Are we scanning for poison? Lipids, carbohydrates, water, salt. Okay. God, 2.2 grams of salt? I'm not like surprised. Just to have in a day. Sugar, pineapple, passion. Oh, God. Gross. Uh -oh. Thanks, Gary. I'm starving. Don't leave that thing here. Huh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. See? <laughs> See? <laughs> Thank God I can pause it. Oh, gambling <laughs> cholesterol <laughs> company. <laughs> <sighs> oh my god, what should we say? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like everything's gonna piss him off. <laughs> I know, I know. Mm. Let's ask him about the company he keeps. I don't want to alarm you, Lieutenant, but I think your friends are engaged in illegal activities. Oh god, <laughs> baby. You get by. As long as they're not hurting anybody, I don't bother them. Interesting. I kind of want to ask about, like, I want to ask about the gambling. This Pedro, he was proposing illegal gambling. Am I right? Yeah. And you made a bet. Yeah. Connor is confused. Connor is confused. <laughs> Do you eat here often? Most days. Gary makes the oh. best burger in Detroit. Really? What's that locked thing? Again! Mm. About Connor. What does that mean? Okay, well, let's do that. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um. Hell no, yes. Make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice. Hey! Cyberlife androids He's are designed cute. to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. <laughs> mm. Rude. I know. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate androids so much? I have my reasons. <sighs> He's not ready. He's not ready yet. Okay, okay, <laughs> At least he didn't get upset. He's really eating that hamburger, by the way. <laughs> Maybe I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can mutation. lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions, which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Sure, keep telling yourself that, sweetie. Emotions always screw everything up. He's new. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. Mm, mm. Wise words. You ever dealt with yeah. before? Yeah. A few months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with a little girl. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me? Mm. Right. Not true. I know you graduated top of your class. 
You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years, and you spend a lot of time in bars. So what's your conclusion? I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge. But adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. That was adorable. <laughs> I'll let you finish your meal. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I can't believe he winked at him. I know. I like, all right, I'm starting to like that bastard. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> He's kind of cute, actually. <laughs> you run out of batteries or what? I'm what sorry. happened? I was making a report to Cyberlife. Oh. Well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. I'm coming. <laughs> Should oh. we be able to do that instantly? Maybe they were inquiring. What do we know about this guy? Not much. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but the neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh, Christ. If we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise, we're gonna need more cops. Mm. Hey, were you really making a report back there in the elevator? Correct. Oh, they fa the facial expressions are done so well. Anybody home? Open up, Detroit police! Yeah! Oh. Stay behind me. Got it. Do we have a warrant? Do we need a warrant for this place? Matter. Careful, Hank. Oh, oh God! Oh, the fuck is this? Pigeons. Why? Uh, Jesus, oh my God! There's so many. Stinks. Whoa! What the heck? It's a bunch of pigeons. Uh, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's gone. Why is it filled with pigeons? Maybe he likes Suspect pigeons? Suspect doesn't eat. Weird. Am I gonna be evaluated oh, after this? Oh. oh, they're so cute! Cares for wild animals. They were taking care of the pigeons? It seems so. Military jacket. RT. Probably initials. He put his initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. <laughs> hmm. Forgery. Driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. Ah, oh, so many pigeons! So many pigeons! <laughs> oh, look! RA9. Uh -oh. Any idea what it means? RA9. Written 2,471 times. It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Why are they obsessed with this sign? Hmm. Looks like mazes or something. Hmm. Oh. oh yeah. What are they? Jesus. Marker. 
Recently. recently. Okay. Obviously, recently disturbed. Was this where they were? Did we hear this get knocked over? Maybe so. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's what we heard. Okay. <sighs> uh, charmed. Uh, gross. Are you going to taste it? Oh. <gasps> He's injured. Oh my oh, god. He took <gasps> Bio component. Its LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. Yeah, no way. Don't be surprised. There's some crazy God, animal borders. I <laughs> it's just so unsanitary and there's no food. They're like, it's just so terrible living conditions for a human. Mm hmm. Skid marks. Mm. Fingerprints? No fingerprints. Okay. Probably because they don't have fingerprints, or they, yeah. he talked about that in the first crime scene. Wait, what? What is this? It's a cha it's a oh, it's a cage. Okay. Oh, he, he must have knocked that over. Yeah. Okay. What are we looking at here? Ooh, is he in the <gasps> oh my god, suspect is still here. Hank, be careful. God, I love the music in this game. I know. This. Urban farm. There must be something here. Real books. I thought I was the last guy in Detroit to keep some. Hmm. Electronic what is books, it? you can't smell the paper. Whoa, See, what uh, is this? Pages turning yellow. What the heck? You have no idea what I'm talking about, do you? Amazing. Found something? Oh, he, he kept that. A bunch of mail. He, like, he, like he's it writing like on the a wall. Note, but it's indecipherable. Look, like the symbols. The wall too. Yeah. They're mazes. Yeah. That's what Hank was saying. Mazes are... That's what they look like, but I think there's something else maybe. Hank just now saw the bird scene. <laughs> I can't believe it. This nut job was actually feeding these fuckers. Well, durr. Hey. Uh, oh, shoot! Goddamn fucking pigeons! What are you waiting for? Chase it! Not another chase! Action, Action, Connor! I hate quick time events! Kill me now! <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Hey! Oh wait, can I... Balance, safe for detour, fast and risky? I don't know! Oh man. Look out. Excuse me. Uh. Uh. Uh, action counter! <laughs> oh, shoot. Uh, my 
Come on, come on. Oh! What are you doing? Whoa! Ah! Ah! No way Hank could do all this, so. Oh god, I hit the wrong right button! Shoot! Oh god! Oh god! Oh no! I think I might die! I think I might die! Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Did I fail? Am I dead? Oh my, oh my god. god, I died! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Why does Connor keep dying? Why does he keep dying? I keep having to reset because Connor keeps dying and making Hank angry. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> Operation Don't Let Connor Die Again. <laughs> so far, that plan is not going so well. He has died he's, so many you times. Him every opportunity. I have. <laughs> oh God, this is like it's like all Connor does is chase people. I swear, scan things and chase people. <laughs> okay. I just feel like Connor wouldn't fail. Because he should I know, be able right? to calculate all this instantly. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm just focusing really hard right now. Just gotta focus, focus. Oh god, it's the same! No! Ah! Ah. Whoa. Oh my god! Ah, you made it! I made it! <laughs> Hank knew a shortcut. Somehow, yeah. Ah! <laughs> uh. Uh. Come on! You're the most advanced, like, one there is! Crowded. Easiest decision I've ever made in this entire game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no question. Hey, Connor. Nothing. Yeah, you're the yeah, word you're looking you for. The word you're looking for <laughs> is thanks. <laughs> you're welcome. I love you. <laughs> yeah, all right, I did it. Connor yeah. just died finally. <laughs> oh my god, I bet you. Could he have died? Could Hank have died? I, I bet so. Uh, I bet so. Uh, horrible, no. Whew. Oh, man. I, uh, that, those quick timing events give me so much anxiety. I know. Like, ah, I don't know we're going like to feel it in my Hank, bones. No matter what. But also, I'm not, like, that concerned about catching the poor little pigeon-loving android. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Yeah. Oh, no, he got away. Right, here we go. Is it possible to flirt uh, with Hank? <laughs> oh, my God. These are the questions. The real Make questions. Make more uncomfortable. <laughs> Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. Hey, Simon. H what? Trail. Jericho. Trail? This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. And you 
knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you mm. could decipher the signs, it's because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. Mm, that's not true. Mm. I came to Jericho looking for hope. Looks like I'm not going to find any here. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Until Connor finds us. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Lucy? No, is he is leaking? He, is he bleeding? Bleeding, I mean? <laughs> leaking. Well, you know. <laughs> same, same difference. <laughs> I guess technically when we bleed, it's still leaking. Oh, can I go talk to some of these? Hey! What's up? All the androids, like, most of the androids are, like, so pretty. Hmm, <laughs> why wouldn't they be? Oh, that's a big one. Look how big that guy is. Mm. Oh, interesting. Would we want to start are they powered fire? down? Maybe for light? Uh, oh god, is this one okay? Oh my. Humans are afraid of dying too. What's wrong with her? Happens after death? No one does. No. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. I was glad to meet you, Marcus. What on earth? What, what the? What happened to her? Guess she got damaged beyond repair. Okay. Um, well, that was horrifying. Is, that was vegan. actually horrifying. Is that humming? What's going on? This place is creepy as shit! It is. You can spruce the place up a little bit? Whoa. Are you Lucy? Oh. What on earth? Sit down. What? Okay. Is she okay? Show me. Uh. Oh. Why didn't that part? I'll stop the bleeding. Like he was like in pieces. Yeah, but I don't know. I'm confused. What are the, what are the, like, rules? I don't know, there definitely seems to be some inconsistencies. Yeah. Yeah. Drink this. Is that their blood? Okay. Is 
Is that it? Are we gonna have a conversation? Give me your hand. You gonna probe his mind? You had it all, and you lost it all. Yeah. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Why? She's like the oracle. Is she some kind of yeah? Like how how would she, why would she say that? Is he special somehow? I don't understand. That was interesting. Yeah, I have so many questions. Can I talk to her again? I'm confused. I just I need I need to I need to talk about this briefly about his wound just now because he was literally in pieces he mm -hmm. both his legs were missing they had clearly been torn off and he was all effed up and yet oh i even got a tiny little cut that i how did you get it where was I don't it know. we definitely have seen some inconsistencies it's not the first one like for example yeah. when they cut out the the ring on their forehead they don't bleed but then that one time connor yeah. found that and it was like oh there was blood here because he ripped this thing out i'm like okay why didn't the other two characters bleed when they tore theirs off yeah now i mean that um, one you could explain away like maybe older models it was more integrated and you couldn't yeah just but then there's it, also but... inconsistencies with like the same character like in his case maybe his his fluid pump got damaged maybe that fluid is what heals them remember he had to get a new one yeah maybe that liquid is what heals him and maybe it got damaged and that's why he was not able uh, to heal hi. I, don't, I don't know i don't know i'm confused i'm confused and i need answers also God, the camera really angles in this game i still game. don't understand that scene where connor like gets punched by that guy and he like buckles over, over into yeah the ground, and i'm like you got shot in the beginning of the game. You didn't even flinch. <laughs> yeah, and you were just like, mm. yeah, you just like looked at it. He just like looked at his shoulder like, mm. it was a mild inconvenience. Oh man, this one's messed up too. What's wrong I'm with them? My diagnostic program isn't working. <laughs> I don't think it would have anything good to say anyway. What happened to you? They tied me to the back of a car. I think they wanted to have fun. No. I don't want to shut down. That's awful. No. I don't want to shut down. You can't help him? <sighs> we need a yeah, better this... setup here. I'm really wondering... I, I need someone to explain some things to me because as effed up as he was, why is like he's fine? I don't understand. Like is I it don't understand it either. I really need to understand if it, is it is it because of like the model type that he is? Is, is it like is it a specific component that if it gets damaged they can't heal anymore? And you're right. Maybe it maybe it does have to do with his model. Maybe the other ones are older models. Yeah, I, 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 I which I, I can accept. Like you know, like some models are more prone to damage and can't heal themselves. I would, I, I would accept that. That's fine. That makes that can make that makes total sense to me. But you know, I need someone to say it. <laughs> and all it would have taken was like, oh yeah, you're one of those F one forties. Yeah. You guys couldn't heal your... What the? Is, is that an android child? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. 
To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. But on Earth? We're slowly dying out. Well, they need, like, maintenance? Continually get more blue blood? I would imagine so, because I would imagine it's just, like, our the fluid in our bodies, like, they use it. Also, they can get cut mm. and lose it, but it's probably, like, you know... Gotta figure out how to manufacture it. <laughs> That's awful. Why would they get an android, like a little child? Was it to replace their son, but he just wasn't the same? I don't know. Can, I... <sighs> Can you imagine being Oh, they might have wanted like to like, be a companion to their... Oh, to another child. Yeah, maybe so. Hmm. Interesting. Whenever I light these fires, one of them, like, some of them walk over. You already emptied. Okay. Did they steal these? Probably. on you see what i mean like all, my, all, all i'm doing is this like this is all like uh, it's stupid i uh, know it makes me dizzy like didn't y'all play test this <laughs> jeez north her name is north A lot of these guys in pretty bad shape. Yeah. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. Or we sometimes it's just because. We'll never accept what we are. Well, these guys need spare parts and blue blood. Why hasn't anybody gone to get that? It's not that simple. Where would they get it? shopping at a cyber life store. Nobody wants to risk leaving Jericho. Who found this place? Nobody knows anymore. Whoever he was, his Nobody body's probably laying somewhere on this boat. Mm. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. I don't think he came here for that. I just think he had nowhere else to go. Hmm, okay. Simon? Simon. I know where we can Shine the light parts. in his eyes. Cyber Life Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here anyway. to be shut down. Yeah, we're gonna die Maybe. anyway. Maybe it's worth a try. Okay. I'm in. Oh my god. Oh my god, is this the first time I've done everything? Wait. Oh my god, I did everything! Yeah. It can happen. <laughs> they do exist. I just, I feel like... I feel like no matter what we do, it's only going to be a temporary fix. Even if we steal all the parts we need, if they're going to need continual maintenance, like, what are we going to do? Just 
wait and then eventually steal it again. I mean, every time they do something like that, the humans are going to be more and more prepared every time. They're not going to just keep laying down and letting their equipment get they, stolen. They, they need like... a they need a permanent need to do solution. Like, like what they did in Transcendence. We need to like find somewhere in the middle of nowhere and build our own yeah. stuff. Yeah, so that we can start manufacturing what we need. Which I feel like that would be the long term goal, but I don't know how they would do that. But I mean, they've got to start trying to think of something for the future because otherwise they're all just waiting in that ship to die. Mm-hmm. I can't wait for all these quick time events that are surely gonna happen when we steal all that stuff. Yay! Mm-hmm. <laughs>